And let's kick things off in Cochise County this Veterans Day. The Wall of Faces Museum, located in the Gadsden Hotel in Douglas, started as a temporary exhibit back in 2016, but has continued to grow and now features about 800 veterans from Douglas. Kagan Nine's Madison Thomas takes us inside. Walking from room to room in this museum, you not only see the faces of those who have served, but you also learn about their stories. And I had the privilege to sit down and talk to several of the veterans that are featured on these walls and learn about their personal experiences. When I first saw it, I walked around here, I go, oh my God, I went to school with these guys, you know, they, and they served and they didn't know it. Basically, as long as a man's story is told, they do not die. So you tell their story. And numerous Douglas veterans have had their story told with the help of pictures, uniforms, and artifacts. It's about young people, their lives, their experiences. In 2012, former President Barack Obama asked communities to honor Vietnam veterans, which sparked the idea for the Wall of Faces. The way we started was we were going through the annual high school annuals. And they were saying, okay, well, this guy, this guy was in, I think this guy was in. And then we started asking the folks for help. And little by little, uh, it just grew. But that was just the beginning. We're expanding to cover World War II, Korea today, you know, cover veterans of Douglas uh, because it's important. And they all have stories to share, some about obstacles they had to overcome. When we tried to get a job, oh, Vietnam veteran, no, forget it. Don't, don't even try it. Just go and pick chili or go to the fields and work. And that's what I did. Friendship. I met him in Vietnam, even though he's from Douglas. Oh, wow. And I met him in Vietnam. The best thing about it is that ever since 1970, we call each other every Saturday for the past 54 years. Loss. We went to a priest and they told us, some of you, uh, some of you guys are going to make it and some of you guys are, will never make it back. And it did happen. It was really... When I served, and then I found out that there was a friend of mine that got killed, I could have, uh, And while these stories give visitors a better understanding of what veterans have experienced, it also shows veterans the community they have. I thought I was only maybe a handful of veterans that had served in Vietnam. But when this came up, I said, wow. You know, I didn't realize that. Reporting from the Wall of Faces Museum at the Gadsden Hotel in Douglas, Madison Thomas, KGA 9.